Well, since announcing in March that in-person ceremonies would not take place due to COVID-19, Purdue is making strides to create a memorable experience for the class of 2020. News 18's Marvin Bills spoke with a student who shares what it was like to walk across the stage virtually. Okay, Meet Isha Patel. She was one of hundreds of students who celebrated her graduation virtually. Initially, I was thinking it wasn't going to end up super well. Although Patel had no idea what she was in store for, it turned out to be a better experience than she thought it would be. I'm, just, I'm beyond ecstatic the amount of time that Purdue put into making that virtual ceremony, giving us the commencement box, sending our diplomas in. While Purdue did as much as possible to make the moment special, Patel did as much as she could by decorating her living room, dressing up in her cap and gown, and inviting her mom all the way from San Jose, California, to share this special moment with. For my mom to be here and just share in this experience, she's just been like the biggest support in my entire life, and this moment without her would just not even be worth it. Her mom was just as excited and grateful that she could be a part of this experience during this time. It was awesome. I cannot thank Purdue enough the way they planned it and made it so surreal, you know. That is awesome. Patel received a Bachelor of Science degree in industrial management. Celebrating her success wasn't the only thing she looked forward to. Earlier in the year, she was nominated to speak in front of her division at graduation. It was, it was the best to get that call and being able to represent my class that way is, I couldn't ask for anything else. She says while it was exciting being able to give a speech, her message was one she truly wanted to convey. Even though this is like a really rough time, that doesn't mean that we can see the good in it. Um, and so I talked a lot about moments in between milestones. It's kind of nice to see that there's some moments and some things that go beyond just being there physically um, and that you can feel that love even though you're away from each other. At Purdue University, Marvin Bills, News 18. Isha is going back home to San Jose, California to spend some time with family before starting her new job as a financial analyst for Microsoft in Seattle, Washington.